All right, race fans, a, a really welcome sight here at, at good old Sonoma. Our pal Mimo Gidley's back walking, even though he's not walking quite as fast as he usually does. He's got a little bit more metal in him than he had about a year ago. First of all, kid, good to see you. Tell us how you're feeling. Well, I'm feeling a heck of a lot better. Uh, you know, it's uh, just over six and a half months uh, since the accident happened, and uh, it was horrible at first. And uh, But, man, it's just nice to have that light at the end of the tunnel shining brighter like it is now. The pain's gone down, and I feel, uh, I mean, I was so excited to come out here. I woke up at, like, 4 in the morning and couldn't go back to sleep. So, When uh, you had a horrible crash at Allcart Lake in your cart days when you were running good for Chip Ganassi, and that looked awful, and you were racing two weeks later, I think you had a concussion maybe or it banged you up a little bit this thing looked bad from the start but you told me there down the phone the best thing was is you don't remember much well yeah I mean whenever you have a traumatic experience if you remember it then you have nightmares and I think in the in the uh, some doctor or hospital they asked me do you have flashbacks or nightmares like I don't remember anything so it seems perfectly fine to me so yeah it's nice not to remember it best way to get hurt is not to remember it <laughs> worst way to get hurt is all the stuff that you had broken and shattered and all the other things the uh, and we talked on the phone the other day. I mean, you're coming around, it almost look like kind of a blind corner, and there's a guy basically stopped in the track. Yeah, I mean, I, I like I can't remember anything, but I do look back at the replays, and I see I was trying to pass a uh, Ferrari at that point, and, and he must have saw him last minute because then he darted to the right in front of me, and so I immediately darted to the left because I didn't know there was someone stopped there, and boom, that was it, and I ran into him right there. Shouldn't have been stopped on the track, you know, as a lesson. You know, we always learn from things. People get hurt, we learn from stuff. Uh, you know, if your car is going slowly, you got to get off the track because we can't see him at Daytona or anywhere. Right. Yeah. The fact that you were always in such good shape and a physical fitness nut and, and really ate the right stuff, did the doctors say that probably helped this thing? I mean, even though it's been six months, it's really helped you get to where you are at now? Absolutely. I mean, I've done everything the doctors have told me to do, and then I've gone so far outside of the box that I do Chinese herbs, I do acupuncture, I do hyperbaric chamber, um, you know, I do a, a ton of different th things, you know, vitamins, also holistic uh, approaches with people. And the way I've approached it is if it's not hurting me, it's probably helping me. And it's, things have happened so slowly on how they get better, I can never relate it to one thing. I'm just trying to do as many good things as possible to get back as soon as I can. All right, when you see get back, back in a race car. Oh, absolutely. Back in a race car, back in my go-kart, back in my jet ski, back in my sailboat. I mean, I have so many things that I love to do. It all involves racing. But yeah, get back into a race car, number one. Well, I talked to you about three months ago, and I sent you Alex Zanardi's book and I think a, a video of Mario and Gurney and Parnelli that we did a couple years ago. And that $2,000 I loaned you, I don't need it right now, but, you know, if it, if, it, if it comes back in your memory soon, just send me a check. But uh, it's great to see you, brother, and uh, everybody here at Honda and everybody here in the paddock is happy Mimo Goodley's walking again. We'll see you back in a race car soon. Hey, uh, you know, I just want to say uh, how much support that I've gotten. It's been amazing, and I think I've returned uh, emails up to, like, uh, February 18th. <laughs> so I'm a little bit behind, but it's just I really appreciate it, and uh, I know it could be a lot worse, and I just really thank everybody for being behind me. I'll get back out there, guaranteed. Let's go, Mimo! Woo! Robin Miller, Racer.com. Thanks for watching.